Where are you going? I'm going to the teacher Jamie. Teacher Jamie, you want you want to see teacher Jamie? Yep. Yep. What you will do with teacher? You will play with the toys. Play the toys. And then what else? You study? You study with teacher Jamie? Yes. Yes. You're a good boy. Now after we we go to teacher Jamie, where we will go? Going home? We're going home? After going to teacher, going home now? Play powerful. Hmm? Pirate. Play powerful pirate. We're playing pirate. We will, we will play. Pirate. We will play pirate. Horrible pirate game. Okay. We will not go to Jollibee. We'll go McDonald's. You like to go to Jollibee? You wanna go? I want to go to Jollibee. How do I go? To what? Jollibee. <laughs> so silly. You're silly. We're like, this is silly boy. You wanna go to Jollibee? How about McDonald's? How about a Jollibee fries? A Jollibee fries. Hello mommies and daddies. Hello parents. It's Angelica Lucas again for another vlog. So, ang tagal ko nang um, hindi nakapag-update about sa speech delay and sa autism spectrum disorder. Um, almost one year then nag-stop um, kami because of the pandemic because we come back from UAE, we come back to Philippines na and nagbago na naman yung environment and nagbago na naman of course yung therapy center namin dito sa Pilipinas and guys I wanna share lang sa inyo uh, ang update so after one year na hindi nagka-therapy si Lee, ano na ang nangyari sa reassessment namin last February 2021 so last month last month um, end of end of last month so, nag-decide kami, nakakita na kami ng open na face-to-face -face na speech therapy for for RIV. And, we decided na i-continue yung speech therapy niya. So, guys, hindi dahil nakakapagsalita na si RIV, nakikipag-communicate na is kailangan mag-stop na kami. As much as possible, mas um, continuous yung therapy niya is makakatulong yan sa kanya. Yes, of course, mahal siya. Reassessment reassessment cost is 1,800, but naka-discount kami um, ng 300 to 1,500 lang yung uh, pinayara namin for the uh, reassessment dito sa Pilipinas. Um, after introducing um, kay Reed na magka-therapy ulit siya, um, na meron siyang bagong teacher, ganyan. Hindi kami nahirapan kasi first um, naisip namin baka hanapin niya yung old therapist niya. Kilala niya kasi yung old therapist niya tapos alam niya yung name. So, naging madali naman sa amin. We are lucky talaga na nakakita kami ng therapist na mabait sa bata. At tinatanong ko ano yung mga gusto namin talaga. Hindi lang ano yung sinabi ng doktor or last na therapist niya. Tinatanong din um, ng therapist na to kung ano ba yung plans namin at gusto namin ma-achieve for Reef, bakit namin siya um, kinuntinyo for the therapy. And really, we are, we are very lucky na super mabait yung therapist na to. Um, makikita mo ang love niya yung ginagawa ng work and love niya yung mga bata. And jolly person siya. So makikita mo kasi sa therapist kung ano siya eh, kung nagtatrabaho lang siya because job niya yon or ginagawa niya yung trabaho niya kasi gusto niya talaga ma-improve yung bata. So, yun ang una namin nakita sa therapist. After the reassessment ng first day, so, diniscuss niya, Reeve is 6 years old na, but yung speech delay niya is yes lang dun pa rin. So, ang speech niya ngayon is considered 4 or 4 and a half um, years old. So, ang speech niya, ang progress niya, based sa mga Based sa mga sagot niya, based sa behavior niya, he is considered as 4 to 4.5 years old. It's, yes, it's because hindi naman kami nagulat kasi yun din naman yung 
yung naisip namin kasi nga may kulang pa rin naman so one sentence nakakapagsalita na siya but more we need we really need him to speak um, more sentences and yung makakapagsabi na siya ng story yung talagang may isang story na siya may kukwento sa amin ganun so during the first um, session as a new therapist Ang behavior ni Reeve is nakikipag-participate siya, sumasagot siya. Um, meron siyang hindi nasagot kasi ang ginawa nila is parang five commands. So, meron siyang isang word na hindi hindi na-emphasize but upon repeating naman ng therapist, yun, nakukuha naman niya. Which is good. And meron din silang pattern na after completing the task, dun lang siya makaka -uwi. Which is a good then carry it kasi finalo niya. And actually, nahirapan pa yung therapist na it's time's up na, you need to go home. Reeve wants to to study or to play pa with the therapist. He wants to stay. So, medyo nahirapan na, oh, stop na Reeve, next time naman, ganyan. So, all in all, the, the first session is good. Um, Nakipag-participate si Reeve. Hindi niya hinanap yung old na therapist niya. Alam niya na yung nangyayari ng new therapist to. And Reeve is just enjoying the therapy. He's not putting pressure on himself. But, eto nga. So, para ma-achieve nating parents, yung gusto natin sa anak natin, hindi lang dapat tayo nagre-rely sa therapist so, we need to do is lahat ng itinuturo ng therapist for the, that session, we need to teach din sa bahay. So, the more na iti-teach natin to sa bahay na susundin natin is the more improvement yung makikita natin sa anak natin. So, the therapist is just our guide. So, guide lang natin siya mga parents but tayo talaga ang magtuturo sa kanya sa everyday life. So, yun guys, I will update you on another session. And hopefully, ma-achieve namin yung goal namin for Reef before. Because before, before he reached 7 years old. So, yun yung plan namin. So, bago siya mag-7, is naging proof ang speech niya. At least, makakapag-tell the story na siya. For example, yesterday, he went to child and he ate what he ate there, what he ordered. So, in yung goal namin. So, gusto namin is ikukwento na niya sa ibang tao na iyon ang ginawa niya. Kasi kulang pa eh. More on answering question. So, for example, another person is will ask him repeatedly bago siya sasabot. So, we want to achieve is he himself tells a story. So, ayun. And para na rin alam niya aware siya sa mga nangyari sa paligid niya. Ganyan. Na, at kailangan niya makipag-communicate himself not just answering question. So, thank you guys for watching on this video and I hope um, sun subaybayan nyo ang aming speech um, therapy progress. And I will give you tips then kung ano-ano yung mga kailangan nyo um, i-emphasize para maturu maturuan nyo ang um, inyong mga anak. Thank you guys for watching. Oh! <laughs>